let's get into it what's up y'all welcome back everyone thank you for watching my channel she's got the gift your girl is back and better like i never left i'm here to do a reading for you okay please take what resonates from these messages that's being delivered to you don't take it personal if you can't take it personal okay but if it is hitting home for you and you need some more personal you want a personal reading from me reach out to me my website will be linked down below in the description box also collective i have other platforms on youtube but if you run into them you're a part of my tribe for sure so i will not be displaying them if you guys would like to show some more support um you're always welcome over there on patreon and tiktok but let's jump into your message though collective spirit holy angels i call a conjure at this time i need insight for the collective overall general message spirit angels please continue to protect us Protect our foundation and our loved ones. Allow no weapon that's being formed to come against us to prosper. All black magic, evil entity, spell work being sent is to be returned to sender. Do not allow it to affect us at all. Thank you. Messages, spirit angels, you won't deliver it at this time for my collective. Messages you won't deliver to the collective at this time. Wow. Okay. Okay. All right. That was quick. What the fortune at the bottom of the deck? Mm. What you don't see coming? King of Cups, the High Font, Strength, Queen of Swords, Seven of Wands, Ten of Wands, Two of Pentacles, a higher level of commitment for sure. Mm -hmm. Something stable. Yep. Something protected. Divinely orchestrated here. Yeah, but I feel like this is a masculine that's orchestrating it. I could be talking to a feminine or I could be talking to you masculine. This feminine is standing on business. It looks like she's not letting up until she get exactly what she deserves. And I feel like somebody is getting that. But let's see. Nine of Swords coming through. Knight of Wands here showing up. Six of Pentacles and the Two of Wands. Yeah. Yeah. This is weighing somebody down too. This is weighing somebody heavily down. Why? Because I feel like they want to come in. Whoever this person is, is for sure. For sure they want to come in. But... The only reason why they holding back collective or the only reason why you holding back is because this feminine here is in that energy. She not allowing nobody to play with her no more. Or this masculine is in his energy and not allowing to, nobody to play with him anymore. This could have something to do with the cancer masculine. Taurus feminine is here. Leo feminine is here. Libra as well. Show me more about this. Why this person in their head like this? Inside on Nine of Swords. Someone is also stressed out, too, about the actions they made. Like somebody moved entirely too fast, didn't think something through, went against your back and gave to somebody else here. And now it's like, ugh, it's two people that somebody dealing with and they don't know if they picking the right person or if they, they, they messed up here or stressed out because they picked the wrong person. This is crazy. Inside on Nine of Swords, Spirit Angels for the Collective. Nine of Swords energy. Who is this? Who is this in the Nine of Swords energy? Five of Cups. Wow. Water. I heard Scorpio. It could be a Cancer here. Or a Pisces. There's emotional loss here, though. Show me more about this. I'm hearing sirens in the background. Eight of Cups. Oof. This is a water sign here. Stressed out about this ending. They mad though. Whoever this is is stressed out because somebody is walking away. Like uh, uh, deciding here to detach from this person emotionally. You know, once you detach from a person, once your emotions is out of it, that's it. This is what they worried about the most. They know that you emotionally detached from them. Or you know this. Five of Wands here showing up. Mm -hmm. Well, of fortune. Yeah, all of that is coming. All of that is it. That's it. That's a wrap. Sagittarius energy is here. Scorpio energy is here. Cancer, Pisces. Seven of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. Somebody here, look, the fool, the two of Pentacles. Somebody here is moving into something more fulfilling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got Death High Priestess here. Nine of Pentacles. Somebody is like the fool. Yeah, somebody here is deciding to leap towards something else. And this person here is stressed out. 55 here is showing up too. This person is the one that started all of this stuff. Five of Cups here, Five of Wands. This person is the one that initiated all of this drama and putting people in competitions. And now they the one that's stressed out. But they letting you know something here is closed. Inside on this nine of wands, who is this coming up? Who is this uh, coming towards the collective spirit angels? I just heard showing up. So somebody here could be showing up to your doorstep. 
trying to show up. It said on the Knight, Knight of Wands. The Knight of Swords. Yeah, somebody here. The Six of Wands. Wow. Somebody here planning on coming in and wrapping it all up. Showing you the pub, showing you the notoriety here that you need, or showing you recognition. Like somebody here, like wants whoever this is that's coming towards you, want it to be known, want it to be like you know, seen, want it to be public displayed out there that they're coming towards you or they want to be with you. Or you want this, you going towards your person with this. Show me a little bit more information on this, spirit angels. Give me a little bit more. This could be you that has this decision to make at the end of it all. The tower, heavy on Scorpio energy out here. Show me more. Yeah, but something is unexpected. You don't see this. Um, if you a Taurus and you ain't watched it, the reading that I titled Expect the Unexpected, go watch that. But if you got Taurus in your chart, are you dealing one? I highly suggest you go get those messages because it's like coming in from this. The Hierophant, yeah. Um, the Emperor, wow. The six of pentacles, wow, and the seven of pentacles. I told you that what you don't see coming is somebody here with the, you know, whoever this is either coming with a new approach or this is definitely something new. But the universe is align, aligning this. The tower is clarified here with the higher front. The higher, the emperor came right after the higher front. The six of pentacles here, then the seven of pentacles. 66 is significant. Eight, seven, and nine. Just like that. Not, not in order. Eight, seven, nine is very significant. That could be somebody's number. Yeah. There's like an equal give and take here. There's something here reliable too, like something worth the the worth the water, like you know. Something is also coming down like whoever this is. Who is this? Who is this emperor here? Something is also crumbling. Somebody could have been in something like for a very long time, a long-term marriage, a long-term commitment. I just feel like that is what's blowing up. Somebody's investments is blowing up. Somebody money, somebody like losing money. And then it's like whoever on the receiving end is getting this new partner. They serious. This new partner here could be an Aries. This new partner here could be a Taurus or a Scorpio. One more. Who is, the, who is the emperor? I was about to say, who is the Aries? The emperor here is a feminine energy. The boss is the feminine energy. Somebody who reliable, somebody who's stable, somebody who can hold their own. Somebody here can have a child by her or a child by him. Whoa, what was that? Four of Wands. Look, y'all, you seen that flip out? Mmm. Somebody showing up to someone's doorstep. Somebody here is like something is breaking down and something is coming together. Something is breaking down for something to come together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it looks like it's like, you know, it's it, it's protected. Four lines here, solid, stable. The, the, the tower's already out here. Something has already been broken down. Something has already been dismantled. Somebody is growing up. Somebody bossed up here. Somebody here can pay their own bills. Or this is what they're currently doing right now. And what you don't see coming in here is somebody that's going to be on your level. Inside on the Six of Pentacles. The Eight of Wands. The Star. It could be an Aquarius coming in. It could be an Aquarius coming in. Uh, Taurus here. Virgo or Capricorn, but I see communication. I see like positivity coming from this communication. I see happiness. I see it's something that you wanted is coming in. Why is the collective gonna have a decision to make, Spirit Angels? Inside on this two of wands, why is the decision here? So the competition, whoever was in competition with you with this five of wands is the one that's being left out and they're stressed out about it. The one who left somebody out is coming towards you. Yeah, there was a tower that blew something down, but it was it was faulty anyway. It wouldn't have never failed. It wouldn't have never blew over. It wouldn't have never caught fire. You know what I'm saying? It wouldn't have never failed, period, if it was solid. And something now is like 
opening. Something is open and it's solid and it's ready to move forward. Insight on this two of wands. Yeah, it's ready. Something's ready. Um, Death here showing up more. Scorpio energy. Show me more. Transformation here. Turning a life around or something here. The Wheel of Fortune out here. The Hierophant, the Four of Wands, the Tower, the Emperor. All of these majors out here. Then Death showing up with the Two of Wands. This transformation here. This, this somebody here having an uh, outlook on life here. It's like somebody good transforming dead putting putting shit to rest it's over with for somebody growing up ten of cups here nine of swords nine of swords over here again why i also feel like too somebody is being haunted about something that they did i just the the vision that uh your angels just gave me mm. Mm. Show me more on this. Oh my. Okay. Show me more. Wow. Oof. The sun. Some sort of exposure. Okay. Who is this coming from? Leo energy is here. Like there's a Leo that want to get something off their chest. Or right, there's an Aquarius here. Or there's a Scorpio or a Taurus. Like take it how it resonates. This could be your partner. This could be your one of your partner sign or somebody here in your family. It's like somebody wants to get something off their chest before it's too late. Because something is coming to an end. So, this cycle here is fully closed. and some, Fully closed. It's closed out and somebody new is coming in. But I feel like somebody wants to get something off their chest. And what I just seen is eating somebody up. Like they at home late at night in the dark and they stressed out about it. Whoever this is. Show me more about this exposure. The lovers. The queen of swords. Feminine energy. Could be one of y'all lovers. Could be attached to, uh, to attached to a lover. Gemini energy is out here. Nine of Cups, yeah. Re remember the first thing I seen? I picked up when the car started flying and somebody here was like, move too quick. I think, I feel like this is what's coming out. Show me a little bit more on this. Show me more on the exposure. Who is this? Who is worried? Who is worried? It's a lover. It got, it got something to do with a lover though. An option. With the Nine of Cups here, it's definitely an option. Somebody is worried. And then they also want to speak up before something is too late because I see her or him on the phone, the the like contemplating, going de debating if they want to tell you, debating if they want to like speak, say something about this. The fool showing up here. Uh, it could be an Aquarius that wants to open up and tell you something. But whatever it is, though, I feel like it was foolish. I feel like they were selfish. I feel like they was overindulging. They could have been in toxic under the under the influence of something here. Show me more. The world. See what I'm saying? It's too late, though. Ace of Swords. The truth. On why something really ended. Why somebody receiving karma now? It's like somebody here. I just look. Um, the the devil card showing up. Give me some advice, spirit angels, for the collective. Um, they say expect the unexpected. They are somebody here like wants to speak up. It's somebody now wants to come and speak up at the last minute. I feel like you are gonna get communication at the last minute from an ex lover, an ex -par partner, person. It could be family with the ten of cups here. One more. It's just like some sort of exposure, truth coming out, judgment. Yeah, and it was meant to happen like this. Everything that happened was meant to happen this way. That's why they saying expect the unexpected, but just know that something here is coming. Like some some somebody is being looked on. Somebody here is being is under judgment. The temperance. This could be a Sagittarius that's under judgment. Libra under judgment. Gemini, Aquarius, an air sign under judgment. It could be a Scorpio under judgment. Libra and energy is here. Advice, spirit angels. Yeah, somebody is under judgment. And they trying to come and speak up. They debating. Um, four of cups here, page of cups, something is coming back around. Something is dismantled and something is coming back around. Um, but this is your advice. They saying accept the apology is not, you know what I'm saying? You can accept it and still not move forward with this person because it's somebody you holding back from. This could be a younger person. You could be younger. 
strength you hold all you the ball is in your court like you got somebody by the balls period you do somebody want to speak up they done something and now they want to speak up um but your advice here is to accept the apology and to hear them out with the four cups and the strength card hear them out just hear what they got to say and that you'll your ne make your next move your best move there is somebody new coming in for you though too so that's where the decision come from so i love you collective i'm leaving it there I hope this helped you. I hope you got some type of clarity and insight and guidance. If you did, please show your support back by hitting the like button, comment if you want to. And if you have yet to subscribe, I don't know why you haven't yet. You're a part of the tribe. That's why you're watching. Don't forget, y'all. Stay blessed and prayed up and sucker free. Until next time, peace.